the second initiative that we would like to describe today is for the benefit of faculty members in colleges. So here we would like to explicitly state that uh, NPTEL has an MOU with AICT under which faculty who do advanced NPTEL courses can actually apply for an FDP certificate and convert these courses into FDP equivalent points. That is something that NPTEL kind of uh, worked out with AICT and we uh, did an MOU. So now there is an act which actually uh, formalizes this from our side. So every semester NPTEL will put out from among the courses that are being offered that semester they will also mark certain courses which says that these are available for faculty to take as FDP. The process to get an FDP certificate is the same as a regular learner. Faculty have to enroll to the courses on Swayam, they have to do the weekly assignments, they have to register for the exam and they have to pass the exam as per the certification criteria for that course. Once they have passed it, they can also apply for an additional FDP certificate apart from the NPTEL certificate that they will get. The format that you see on the screen is actually the format that we will be issuing to the faculty who complete such FTP courses on NPTEL. And uh, the conversion mechanism that AICT has agreed upon with NPTEL is that a four week NPTEL course is taken as equivalent of half FDP of one week. An eight week NPTEL course is taken as a full FDP of one week and a 12 week NPTEL course is treated equal into a one and a half FDP. And how can you identify the courses that are available for faculty to take as FDP? So that is marked in the red color there on the right side if you can see it. In every course under the description, if we have mentioned that this is an AICT approved FDP course, that course can be completed in this manner. They can apply for the certificate and get an FDP certificate. So in the July semester of 2023, you can see that out of 692 courses we are totally offering, 581 courses are categorized as FDP courses. You can also see some data here. What is the faculty registration that we are seeing uh, semester after semester? Typically 20% of those who enroll to courses actually register for exams. That is the conversion rate with respect to faculty. And out of that, a subsection actually applies for FTP certificates. So in the Jan 2023 semester, you can see that about 28,400 faculty have applied for FTP certificates from NPTEL side. So uh, one doubt that many learners get because normally when you talk about an FTP program, the audience can only be faculty. So a question that comes is, so these courses which are marked as for FTP, can students and other people not enroll and learn from it? Uh, it is not the case like that in NPTEL. In NPTEL, all courses are open for anybody who wants to enroll and learn. There is no restriction on that. Except that if you are a faculty and you complete these courses that are tagged as FDP courses, you can get an additional certificate on top of the NPTEL certificate, which you can use for CAS points when you are uh, going in for promotion interviews. That is the difference. But otherwise, anybody can enroll to any of these courses and they can learn from it. Mm -hmm.